Polar stratospheric clouds PSCs are clouds in the winter polar stratosphere at altitudes of 15,000 to 25,000 meters (49,000 to 82,000 feet). They are best observed during civil twilight, when the sun is between 1 and 6 degrees below the horizon, as well as in winter and in more northerly latitudes. One main type of PSC is made up mostly of supercooled droplets of water and nitric acid and is implicated in the formation of ozone holes. The other main type consists only of frozen ice crystals and is not considered harmful. This type of PSC is also referred to as nacreous, from nacre, or mother of pearl, due to its iridescence. Topic. Formation The stratosphere is very dry, unlike the troposphere, it rarely allows clouds to form. In the extreme cold of the polar winter, however, stratospheric clouds of different types may form, which are classified according to their physical state and chemical composition. Due to their high altitude and the curvature of the surface of the Earth, these clouds will receive sunlight from below the horizon and reflect it to the ground, shining brightly well before dawn or after dusk. PSCs form at very low temperatures, below minus 78 degrees Celsius, minus 108 degrees Fahrenheit. These temperatures can occur in the lower stratosphere in polar winter. In the Antarctic, temperatures below minus 88 degrees Celsius, minus 126 degrees Fahrenheit, frequently cause type 2 PSCs. Such low temperatures are rarer in the Arctic. In the northern hemisphere, the generation of Lee waves by mountains may locally cool the lower stratosphere and lead to the formation of lenticular PSCs. Forward scattering of sunlight within the clouds produces a pearly white appearance. Particles within the optically thin clouds cause colored interference fringes by diffraction. The visibility of the colors may be enhanced with a polarizing filter. Topic. Types PSCs are classified into two main types each of which consists of several subtypes. Type 1 clouds have a generally stratiform appearance resembling cirrostratus or haze. They are sometimes sub-classified according to their chemical composition which can be measured using litter. The technique also determines the height and ambient temperature of the cloud. They contain water, nitric acid and or sulfuric acid and are a source of polar ozone depletion. The effects on ozone depletion arise because they support chemical reactions that produce active chlorine which catalyzes ozone destruction, and also because they remove gaseous nitric acid, perturbing nitrogen and chlorine cycles in a way which increases ozone depletion. Type Ia clouds consist of large, aspherical particles, consisting of nitric acid trihydrate NAT. Type IB clouds contain small, spherical particles non-depolarizing, of a liquid supercooled ternary solution STS, of sulfuric acid, nitric acid and water. Type IC clouds consist of metastable water-rich nitric acid in a solid phase. Type II clouds, which are very rarely observed in the Arctic, have seriform and lenticular subtypes and consist of water ice only. Only type 2 clouds are necessarily nacreous whereas type 1 clouds can be iridescent under certain conditions, just as any other cloud. The World Meteorological Organization no longer uses the alphanumeric nomenclature seen in this article, and distinguishes only between supercooled stratiform acid water PSCs and seriform lenticular nacreous PSCs. Topic. See also Aurora Circumhorizontal arc Cloud iridescence Noctilucent clouds